there is absolutely nothing I love more than spooky season. I think I've been to the circus before, but never in my life have I been to a spooky circus that's a monster mash theme, but today's the day. <laughs> I'm so excited, man. It's incredible. I saw a poster up in our favorite Thai place and I was like, oh my God, that looks incredible. We looked it up. It's a thing. We're going to a place that's like an hour and a half from here to go watch this. We already got the tickets. I am so excited. We're going with our coworker, Kayla, who you're gonna see in this video. So we gotta get ready because I'm not going to a spooky circus monster mash looking like this. I gotta get spooky. And we're gonna do makeup. Here's the theme I'm going for. I want to embody a vampire witch queen. I went to my favorite little pottery store that's like a small business in our little town and I got this necklace, which I absolutely am obsessed with. I love that the wings kind of look like shells. And I got some earrings that I need to show you. I was wearing them in the talking parts of my last video. I don't think anybody noticed, but I'm obsessed. Let me go get them. It's a little guillotine. Like from a distance, you're like, oh, they look like little windows. Cute, and then you get close, and you're like, oh my God, it's a guillotine. So I wanted something that was still spooky, but I could wear year round if I wanted to, and I've been trying to wear more silver. So those are cute. I'm thinking I might wear my hair up. I need to fix it still, but then that way you can see the earrings, and if it's hot in there, I'm not like sweating. But right now we have to get ready because I think we're leaving in like an hour. Let's go do our makeup. God, I don't usually do makeup. I'm gonna put my bangs back. Cute. <laughs> this is a look. I feel like that's good. I feel like I should put my outfit on. Then we can figure out what to do with my hair. So this is kind of the first fit that I had in mind, which was like all black, head to toe, and then this like cape thing. Is it too much black? I feel like I just look like a black blob. So I've got this purple shirt, and then I have these like fun striped pants. I do like these pants better, they're a lot more comfortable. Okay, what if I think this is what I'm gonna go with? It's too much black still, but I don't have anything else. So I think we're gonna have to go with it. Plus I still have my necklace. Let me get my jewelry. Definitely helps with the necklace. I feel like it breaks it up. I'm gonna put in my earrings. I love this so much. Oh yeah, this is it. This is it. Okay, now we need to do something about this hair. Are we thinking hair down with this look? Imagine this with a red lip. Oh, I'm thinking up. For my bangs, I've just been, hello? For my bangs, I've literally just been like going straight and then curving to the side. And then I do one more curve on the end. So then they kind of just fall into place. Cute. Oh my God, this looks so good. I love it. Let's do a full outfit reveal. I feel very overdressed. I feel like I have not put this much effort into my appearance in a long time, so I just think it's funny that it's for a spooky circus. <laughs> Hi vlog, this is Kayla. <laughs> Kayla, this is vlog. Oh, jeez. Oh, oh you broke it. <laughs> <laughs> Can you tell? <laughs> We're here at the spooky monster mash, and it looks like a spooky entrance, which is exciting. I just our predictions. That's all I want to get is like how we, what we predict is gonna go down. There's gonna be somebody on a giant ball. It's gonna For be sure. a clown. But like a creepy clown, right? I think everything that's like the classic version of it is gonna be like a spooky version of it. Or I don't think it's gonna look that scary. I think it's just gonna be Halloween themed. I want it to be scary though. <laughs> we'll see you inside. Clown comes at me. <laughs> oh my, oh my god. god. Wait. <laughs> Kayla. Can you not put it so close to your face? That's like freaking me out. Packed up, ready to go. <laughs> Bye. <laughs> 
It was at this moment that he knew. There were some impressive parts. The first part was cool. Mm -hmm. Yeah, there were some things that were impressive. I think it's just, it was so not what we expected it to be. So now we're gonna go get Mexican food somewhere. I got the sopes and they were delicious. I give them a solid nine. I give them a solid nine. I give them a okay, solid thank nine. Thank you. That's great. I'm to give you options. Is it recording? Yep. Oh my gosh. Is it gonna be at that angle? Is it gonna look like that? Yeah. I got a quesadilla with beans and rice. Um, I give it a 10. You know, ice cream, you scream beans, you know? That's about it. <laughs> what did you say about the beans? Um, I got a burrito with sauce on it. And I rate it, like, honestly, 10 out of 10. I have no complaints. Except next time we come here, I'm gonna do not with the sauce because it's a little spicy for me. It's delicious, though. Definitely recommend this place. If you're out here, it's amazing. Yeah. <laughs> Clearly, that entire thing did not go the way that we thought it would go. This is what the advertisement was. When we saw the poster and looked at the ticket, this is the images we saw, which was a lot of a higher production value, I think, than what we were given. And what I don't want to do is knock the people that did put on the show and the performance because they did 
their job in the fact that they entertained us, they were putting on a great show for the kids. I think if it was just for children, then that would be okay. The clown was not scary like that. There was no flying acrobat and there was definitely not a girl on skateboards. So it was slightly false advertising. I don't know. I just don't want this to be like a negative thing towards the people that put on the show because I'm sure they're just, they're doing their job. They're just being creative and fun and I don't want to be a hater. So I know I said like, is it a scam? And yes, I got scammed. We didn't, I wouldn't say we got scammed. It was just, I don't know. At least we had fun. <laughs> like at least we got a good show. We got to, drive an hour and a half to go get some really salty popcorn. Like, it was fine. We went out and got some really good Mexican food. I mean, that that's a story for the books, I think. <laughs> that's all I have for today's video. I hope that you laughed <laughs> and that you had a good time. I honestly had a good time. It was kind of sad while editing this and looking back at how excited I was for the spooky event. I got dressed up for it. I put a full face of makeup on. I put a lot of effort into my outfit and I bought jewelry. So I just think I was a little disappointed in the outcome. Now, in hindsight, I can at least say I had fun. <laughs> Give this video a like if you liked it, please. <laughs> and comment down below what spooky thing you think I should go to next. And don't forget to subscribe and turn on post notifications so you get notified every single time that I post a new video. I'll see you uh, in the next one. Bye.